My name is Tom Walters. I'm the sous chef at Devs on Bank Street, and today I'm going to show you how to make our sweet corn and chorizo clam chowder. You start with the chorizo. The chorizo is going to get seared off first. And you get some of the liquid out of the oil and the fat. So you want to get all that fat flavor out of it, brown it up a little bit. We want to add our garlic, let that brown up as well. And you see, getting a little bit more oil in there. So now that you got some of the oil out of the meat, you can use that liquid to wilt the vegetables. So we got our leeks and carrots, celery, and our onion. Now you just want these to be wilted. You don't want them to be too soft. A little bit of crunch to them still, because you know they're going to be boiled in clam juice for a while, so you don't want to kill them. At this point, now that the vegetables are fairly wilted, I'm going to add the wine to deglaze the pan. It gets all the brown bits, all the flavor of the little crispy stuff on the bottom into the soup. And now we're going to continue to let that simmer for a while just to cook the alcohol out of the wine, but still have the flavor of the wine. The heavy cream goes in. Add the corn. Chowder is boiling, we add the potatoes. You'll know when they're ready, they'll be tender enough to cut with a fork. Then you're gonna, you're gonna add your roux, which is just butter and flour, fancy word for that, as a thickener. And once it boils, it'll thicken up, and then you pull it off the heat and let rest. And this is basically a blonde roux. You don't wanna go too dark. The darker it is, the stronger the flavor. And once the potatoes are tender enough where you can crush with a spoon, you add your clams. All right, this is how we serve it. Put all them good chunks in there, colors and flavors. A couple of scallions on top. Serve it with some crusty bread, some crustinis. And there you have it. That's our award-winning sweet corn and clam. Tree so chatter.